Hi guys, it's Kiana and welcome back to my channel. Today's topic is, are weeds, weeds and push-up bras false advertisement? I have a lot of opinions on this because I think that this question, obviously, I mean, it is, it, this, this is not thinking to it, it is. This question is specifically for women you know what I mean? Weaves and push-up bras. But a man can absolutely wear a weave. You know what I mean? There's so much out there now. They can wear the, the fake beards. They can wear the fake weaves. Like men can absolutely do the same thing. So in my opinion of this question... I don't necessarily think that they are false advertisement because whenever I wear a weave, I don't have this weave in 24 seven, like all the time. You know, this weave has got to come out. You know, you have to wash your real natural hair to in order to keep it fresh. So. I don't think that it's false advertisement. I do think it's false advertisement whenever a woman wears a weave and whoever she's dating, seeing, whatever, they don't ever see her natural hair. Then I think it's false advertisement. If you're not comfortable with, excuse me, whoever you're with to show them your natural hair, then something isn't right. You know, I know when I, when my fiance first started courting me, oh, how long was it before he actually saw my real hair? I think it was about a month and a half. It wasn't that long. I had a hairstyle in that was able to stay in for that long. Washed it, took it out, let my hair, my natural hair, you know, get some relief, get some of the tension off that that hairstyle had put on my head you know it gave my hair a break and he saw my natural hair you know he didn't have a problem with it not that that mattered you know any man who has an issue with a woman's natural hair you shouldn't be with that person anyway you know what i mean so he saw my natural hair i was totally fine i was okay with it i was comfortable hmm. i was comfortable around him enough to do all of that you know what i mean and and not care that i think is that's very important you you know being comfortable around somebody to show them your natural hair because some women might not feel comfortable doing that and if they don't feel comfortable doing that i i do not think that that is false advertisement you have men out here nowadays who are balding around this area at the top and still have hair on the sides and in the back and they get a weave they absolutely can get a weave i see it all the time they get a weave keep it in for however long go back to the salon or the barbershop get it redone now are they telling the female or woman that they're with that they have a weave you know what i mean so in my opinion i don't think it's false advertisement if they see your natural hair guys and girls if they see your natural hair i don't think it's false advertisement i think you maybe you want a little length you know or maybe you have too much length and you want something short and you just don't want to cut your hair off you know or maybe you just actually want a protective style for the winter i know i do box braids a lot for the winter and for the summer to keep my natural hair out of my way. It's super thick. It's a nice length. And sometimes I get tired of it. You know, sometimes I do get tired of my natural hair. And so the push-up bras, I think it all depends on the female because I remember there was a time that I wore push-up bras because I was really insecure about the this area. I was very insecure about this area only because 
oh, this started back in like middle school. You know, these middle schoolers nowadays are built, especially the girls, oh, they are built. And that just wasn't my story. I started to feel out in ninth grade. In ninth grade, I started to feel out. But before that, absolutely, I was wearing push-up bras. That's not false advertisement. I don't believe that is. If a woman, a girl, a female wants to feel prettier, if she has insecurities within herself, like I did at that time, and they led to this area, then of course, if I want to make myself feel better, I'm going to wear a push-up bra. It's not like you're getting this push-up bra and it's you're keeping this on forever. You know what I mean? If you eventually want your boobs done, do that. I think you should... I feel as though if you don't like something about yourself, change it. Whether that's permanently or temporarily, change it. If that's what's the difference that's going to make you feel insecure or not or good about yourself or not, then you should absolutely go for it. I do not think that that is false advertisement. Again, you have guys who do the exact same thing in different areas. They do the exact same thing. So... I don't think that this question should be totally based on women with weaves and bras because men do the same thing just with different areas and they might not tell you because they are a man. You know, they may feel embarrassed. They may feel as though oh, a man shouldn't have to do this and that and the other. So I'm not going to tell. Yeah. Like with my fiance, Whenever we would go shopping at Victoria's Secret, this is not a sponsor. Whenever we would go shopping there, you don't all right, I would get a push-up bra. Absolutely. If there was a certain dress I wanted to wear, but I couldn't fit in at the time because of this area, then yes, I would get a push-up bra to better feel out the dress. And it made me feel good about myself. And my fiance loved it. So... I don't think that's false advertisement. I absolutely don't. Now, I know some of you may have different opinions, different views, but think of it as like, don't think of this question as just towards the women. You know, Google, use your Google, Facebook, they all have it where men and women can go to the barber shops and the salons and get a weave put in, or even even braids. Let's just do some, something really simple. Braids. A woman wants a weave. She wants some single braids. You have to have weave, if she wants it. Have weave, whatever. A man comes in, same place. His braids doesn't quite fit his hang time that he wants, you know? What if his hang time is too short? What if he wants hang time that, that's right here on the neck area? You have to wear weave for that. And some men are, like I said, some men are not going to tell you that their braids, they've incorporated weave with that. Because you wouldn't, you wouldn't naturally see a guy wearing weave. So that's more than likely why they would not tell you, you know, but Best believe guys get insecurities just like us women do, just like us women do about their body, about their weight, about the way they look, about their hair. They get the exact same insecurities. Now, what they choose to do with that is their business. You know what I mean? But if you're dating someone and your insecurity is your hair, you always keep it done. You never show them your real hair and you're telling this person, yes, this is my real hair then yes, that is absolutely false advertisement. What's not is you putting a weave in you know, every month or so, or every two months, and they actually get to see your natural hair and you're not telling them, oh no, th 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 this isn't my natural hair. This is weave. You know, I absolutely have no issue with telling whoever that I have in weave. I'm not trying to hide that. You know, my hair is a very nice length. I have absolutely no reason to try to hide that or lie to anybody about 
why I have in a weave or if I have in a weave. You know, honestly, to begin with, it's none of their business. But if they ask, absolutely, if I have in a weave that day, oh, yes, this is weave. You like it? Thank you. You know, <laughs> I don't think that's an issue. But I just think we should be honest with each other, especially as couples. You know, I think you should be more than comfortable enough to tell your partner, this is one of my insecurities. This is what I do to kind of fill in the gap of this insecurity, especially if it's not permanent. If it's not permanent and you're telling them this is a weave or, hey, let me, I need to go get a push-up bra to, you know, fill out this outfit, fill out this dress, this gown, or whatever it is that you're wearing, even a shirt, you know, then do that. I don't think that's false advertisement. I don't. So I know this is a big topic, but let me know your opinions. Let me know if you think that weaves and push-up bras are false advertisement. Let me know why you think that. So please like, comment, and subscribe to this channel. And I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video. Thank you.